today we get to try out a restaurant that we've never been to before. We're going to Woody's Roundup Rodeo for the first time ever, and I'm a barbecue fan and I can't wait. Here is a look at the inside. A little bit of a waiting area. Most people are waiting outside, and they have these fun toy horses for the kids to play with. All right, so the rodeo round, um, Roundup Rodeo has a variety of items, and it is all you care to enjoy, but it's a feast style, so a family style. Though. So they'll bring the platters out, and you can start chowing down when it gets here. They'll start you off with your homemade cheddar biscuits and sweet pepper jelly. That sounds really good. I love cheddar biscuits. Sweet pepper jelly sounds real good, too. Um, then you can start off with your salads. You'll have a root and toot and tomato salad. Um, a Rex's Romaine and Kale salad as well as a Wheezy's Watermelon salad. So it sounds like you'll have a standard salad, a tomato salad, and a fruit salad. Alright, hi! So we're gonna have our salads. After your salads, you get some uh, your choice of either the meat or the um, plant-based trio. We're gonna go for the meat trio or the meat package, just because um, it looks amazing, and that's what we're gonna get. So we're gonna get Evil Doctor smoked ribs, Buttercup's beef brisket. There's a sausage in my boot, fire grilled pork sausage, and barbecue chicken with style. I don't right. know what that means, but. If I follow a style, just like Buzz Lightyear, the chicken's gonna be the style. There we go. Um, you can also get uh, salmon if you are interested um, as a special request. And then you have your choice of four sides that the table will share. There are mean old potato salad, um, the married spuds, which is loaded potato barrels, uh, the, veg the claw vegetable slaw, some coleslaw, force field fried pickles, campfire roasted vegetables, Slinky dog mac and cheese. So does that mean mac and cheese and hot dogs maybe? Slinky dog? I don't know. I, don't know. I was guessing maybe the spiral kind, like a slinky. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Bucking baked beans and cow poke corn on the cob, which is grilled street corn. Mm. It's also for dessert. Everyone gets to choose one mini pie in a jar. So they have Bo's lemon and blueberry cheesecake, Billy's chocolate silk pie, goat's apple pie, Gruff's peach strawberry pie, and um, there's a cupcake for little kids if you need a cupcake. Most spectacular daredevil Canada has ever seen. It's Duke Cabo. I don't know, folks. That's a lot of cattle to clear. Use your imagination. He's flying around on you. Whoa. Yes, Canada. <laughs> Yay! So here is that bread and the jelly so they also <laughs> they have sweet tea here which i'm so excited about here's a look at those salads three different types so we're gonna give all these a try this bread looks amazing jelly on the bread these are the best biscuits they're so good all right so i got all three salads uh oh, something's happening. Yeah. 
That's not a yard sale. Shoo! <laughs> so, I don't know if you just heard the last encounter about the lemonade stand. So this, in the Toy Story movie world, we're tur totally in Toy... We're currently in Toy Story 4, where Woody is adventuring on his own with Bo Peep. Buzz and all the rest of the crew are with Bonnie. And this restaurant is still the toys talking about Andy. So have we gone back in time for this restaurant? I don't is know. There, is there like a, is there any lore? Well, you know what? Forky. story that we don't know about? Because Forky's here too. Yeah, exactly. For That's true. And, and so are the dinosaurs from Bonnie's room. So it's it's beautifully themed. It, this is Toy Story to a T. And it reminds you of riding Slinky. It reminds you of riding Toy Story Mania. But that last story that you just heard means that their stories are not congruent. I didn't know if I would like pepper jelly, but that was good. It is good. These are the best cheese biscuits rolls that you can get. <laughs> the Better best. than that other chain, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, this is really good. This it's this uh, tomato and cucumber so salad. To be honest and honest, if they put a little bit of sliced or fresh mozzarella balls or something in here, it would be amazing. Yeah. But this is really good anyways. And the watermelon was great because it's watermelon. And then the, uh, the house salad. Um, yeah, everything was good. It was really good. I thought that the salad with the apples was just okay. I didn't think it was that great. Watermelon was good, just watermelon. The cucumber, I'm not a big fan of tomatoes, but I liked the cucumbers and the pickled onions. Those tasted good. So, dinner is barbecue. I don't know if you guys know this about me, but I have been smoking my own barbecue for a long time. I love barbecue. I love mm -hmm. trying barbecue mm -hmm. from other restaurants. We have three sauces from Woody's Back uh, Rodeo Roundup. We got the classic. So we're gonna do a little sample taste test real quick before the food gets out. We got the spicy. And we got the sweet. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm just gonna do a little sampling and try them out ahead of time. Classic is your basic, Yellow. traditional, what you'd expect for a, a, a vinegar-based barbecue sauce. It's good. It does have a little kick to it. I would not, I would not call it classic though. This is uh, the sweet. I'm putting it on the roll because it's all we got. Okay. That's your. I don't know if they use Kraft or Ken's or whatever they use, but that's what that is. That's your standard. Buy a bottle of, uh, you know, brown sugar, um, barbecue sauce, whatever you call it. This is your standard, real good barbecue sauce that you can buy from a store. Might actually be Sweet Baby Ray's. Now that I try it, and then the spicy. Okay. I'm gonna be 100% honest. I need it. One second. This classic tastes, they might have, I wonder if they switched the bottles by accident or something, because this classic tastes like the spicy. Okay. okay. The, spicy, the spicy tastes like classic? That might be spicy, Cole. It's not. I think, okay, spicy 100% is the classic with some hot sauce added to it. Okay. And they taste very similar. Which one's your favorite? Sweet, is, I mean, I, I always love a good sweet barbecue sauce, and that one's, Typical store-bought sweet barbecue sauce, so that's what I will probably go with. Thank you so much. Hey, right. our food has come out. We're about to serve it up. Starting with the Slinky Dog mac and cheese. All right, Cole, you want some Slinky Dog mac and cheese? Here's the claw coleslaw. I don't think the kids want any of that. All right, do you guys want some of the potato barrels? All right, does anybody want pickles, fried pickles? Yes, pickles. Take you a pickle. They're fried. Do you want one? You don't want to try it? 
All right, Elijah, I'm gonna give you the sausage. She said she's gonna bring out some more sausage, but Eli was eyeing that one. So we got the ribs, chicken, brisket. All right, guys, Andy's coming. This is the big one. Freeze. Where is it? I know I left it around here somewhere. So far, I tried the sausages and the chicken. Chicken, chicken, as of right now, is the only thing you need to put sauce on. Yeah. Sausages are perfect the way they are. Um, brisket. Oh wow. Mm. That's good. Oh, what happened? Let's give a nice big Andy's Yard salute to our Green Army Patrol. We'll keep us safe around these parts. The table also had this. How well do you know your fellow Wranglers? Answer the questions below without using your gizmos. Don't know the answer? Work together and use your heads. We may not have time to do this because they brought out our food pretty fast. But if you want to check it out, give the video a pause and put your answers down in the comments. I'm curious to know which ones you would get right. I think right, Sid is here again. Oh no, okay. Hold on, you have to hide, 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 hide. No panic, no panic. I'm panicking, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Woo! Hide, Max! Sid's coming. Alright, cowboy toys. I always wanted to set one off into the sunset. Lemon and blueberry cheesecake. I'm pretty sure this is the lemon dummy. Yeah. Cole got the forky cupcake. Our waitress said she got it right out the trash for you. It might be so good. I think that's like a trash. Chad got the strawberry peach pie. Oh. Alright, looks good. Mm, I don't drop it. Magic. <laughs> All right, let's try the cheesecake. Oh man, he goes all the way in. <laughs> That's you, a you good inside, bite that, right there. Mm. Is that is good? it good? Listen, all I right. Will try it for the video. Oh man, all right. Chad hates blueberries. We're gonna give it a try. But I love cheesecake. Yeah. And the lemon, you know. Food, blueberry. Food. There's, there's not a real blueberry on there. It looks like it's just blueberry sauce. Is it Man, on it? That's good. Oh wow! Okay. Good. Strawberry peach pie. I love peaches. I love strawberry. I knew you were gonna order that one. I don't like strawberry one. rhubarb pie. So that I'm glad oh, that this okay. is not strawberry rhubarb. All right. Looks good. You ready? No, no, Star Wars. But I'm. How is it? Are you guys doing? If you can imagine, like you know when you get cinnamon apples like a cinnamon apple pie filling. So it has that same cinnamony flavor. It's very cold, but you can taste the peach instead of an apple. So it's like a peach apple pie filling, but no apples, of course. Okay. So it's like a peach pie filling. I don't, I think the red is the strawberry. I don't, I didn't, let me try again. Okay. So the red is like a strawberry 
you know how they make strawberry syrup with like strawberry, frozen strawberries and, and sugar? And they make the syrup? That's what kind of what it, what it is. But uh, Eli, you can try this since I let you try, since you let me try yours. You don't like blueberries? I don't like, I don't really like pie. It's good though. Alright guys, what's Andy's dog's name? Wow, do we not know anything about Toy Story? I don't know. Yes, Fido? he got a dog for Christmas, remember? Fido? Like at the end of, one, was it at the end That's of number one? His dog's name is Buster. Who says, sweet mother of Abraham Lincoln? Is it ham or Mr. Potato Head? Something sounds like something they would say. What's his name? Who says sweet mother of Abraham Lincoln? I don't know. Who does Woody rescue from the yard sale? Buzz. Mm, no. Car? No. Moby. No. 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 Squeaky dude. Squeaky. Squeaky? Yeah, squeaky. Wheezy. Yeah, wheezy. Is that it? Yeah, maybe, yeah. I don't know. How does Bo Peep the lamp? The lamp, maybe. Oh, yeah, it was. It's, yeah, it's All right, if you guys know the answer, tell us down in the comments. All right, we also, our waitress who's the best, brought us out the apple so we could try all of them. Woo, look at that. All right, I'm going to give Chad the first bite the of apple the pie? apple pie. Tell us how it tastes. Ooh, that was good. Wow. Man. Is it cold also? It's cold. And I love it. Like, okay. You make Jenny here makes a great amazing apple pie. Go to our go to our main blog, you can see it. It's amazing. That is just so good. It, it might be mom? because it's like in these little cups, right? Yeah. And they're in the refrigerator, so they're cold and it all just sticks together real good. Okay. But that is very, very cinnamony. If you don't like cinnamon, you're not gonna like that. But that is good, chunky apple pie. Yard sale in the forward territory. I repeat, yard sale in the forward territory. Okay, yard sale. Oh, this is what Chad was talking about earlier. So listen to the yard sale. Okay, that's Woody. So on the very back wall there's a puzzle and there's puzzle pieces that are missing and our waitress told us they're out in Toy Story land. So we're going to have to head over to Alien Saucers and try to find one. She said there's two. Oh, there's the other one, way at the top. So see, there's another one at the top missing, and then this one is missing so right here. A mountain piece with the sky and like a night sky. Yeah. Okay. All righty. Two pieces missing? Yep. Yep. Oh, they're sitting in the mine over here. Oh, look at the ruler. There is a Woody and Jesse. amazing all right yes there it is the puzzle piece okay that's pretty hidden on the other side of the entrance of alien swirling saucers somewhere here in Toy Story land it's that second puzzle piece that was missing but we are heading over to ride a ride that we have a genie plus pass for so we are heading that way but if you know where the other puzzle piece is, tell us in the comments so next time we come by, we can find it. Me and Max parked on the side to watch the Toy Story, Toy Story Soldiers drumline walk by, and look what was right behind us. The other puzzle piece. 
I hope you enjoyed this afternoon of eating dinner with us at Woody's Rodeo Roundup. Our first time being there, we loved it. Make sure you uh, like and subscribe to the video. Leave any comments you want to ask any questions or anything about the restaurant or the rest of Toy Story Land. Um, if you have anything for us, leave, leave a note in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. And we'll see you on the next one. Later.